Ladies and gentlemen, what a great day to be in Windsor. I'm going to step away from the speaker. We had the governor here today. We had many other political candidates. And now, the moment everyone's been waiting for, we are going to have the awards given out for the best chili, People's Choice. We want to thank Windsor Federal Savings for being our title sponsor. Thank you to Windsor Federal. And without further ado, if everyone wants to gather over, I will introduce you all to the Chili Empress, Lori Hartman. Thank you, Frank, very much. This is 19 years, I can't believe it. I started cooking here 19 years ago and I've been chairing the event for the last 10. It's really, really, time flies. And Windsor Federal has been involved from the very beginning as well. I remember the first booth you guys had. And yeah, it was all, I mean, there was like a dozen of us out here. Windsor Federal was here, so thank you very much. Thank you. We also had uh, some habanero sponsors who uh, paid a little extra, their name is in the program, to help support the event. Century 21 All Points Realty. Heart Mechanical, they are awesome. Wilson Paint and Wallpaper. And Minchie's Frozen Yogurt. I want to mention them because they weren't here. On, well, Century 21 was here, but the rest of them couldn't be here on the green today. But we, they did uh, lend their support today. So thanks to them. And Conica Minolta. Oh, Conica Minolta. We can't say enough about Conica Minolta. They support the chamber in so many ways, and a lot of a lot of us civic organizations that are out there. Conica Minolta does all their printing for us, posters, you know, all kinds of things, banners. They support a lot of civic groups. Uh, Windsor Education Foundation. I'll put a plug in for them. Uh, we want to thank them. Thank you very much, Mitzi and Conica Minolta. Appreciate it. Okay, we're going to start off with our best booth. And we have our chief, uh, I don't know, what's your position? <laughs> no, judge. She's our town clerk, but she's our head judge. So she organizes all the judges. We had eight judges this year, four old, four new. And uh, she and her, uh, our accounting firm of Collins and Collins. <laughs> did all the uh, reconciling of the votes. Um, so, and Robin Stanwyck from Windsor Federal is here. She's going to be presenting the trophies. So, best booth, first of all, there's so many that you guys do excel, it's great. Honorable mention, we have to give to Happy Cat Hotel. Where, come on up here. You guys were close. Honorable mention for Happy Cat Hotel. Chris, where are you? He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. It's not open yet. It's right down here on Broad Street. If you need to uh, leave town, Happy Cat Hotel will be opening soon. And they will pamper your cat like you do your own cat. And take care Thank you. Great job. of your pet while you're away. Good job, Chris. Third place belongs to the JCs. They did an awesome job. Wonka, Wonka, Wonka. Ellen, come on up. Third place goes to the Windsor JCs. They serve the beer and uh, they do a lot for the town. They're involved in everything around town. They uh, host the Shad Derby every year and do a whole lot for our town. Number two for best booth. Kindred Healthcare, AKA Windsor Rehab. <laughs> right over there. 
always tough competitors. Best booth. First place, best booth. Always the biggest competitor out here. And our this year's winner, Dalio Designs, some more chili. Some more chili. You guys did a great job. Thank you. Moving on to People's Choice. Third place was very close. By less than three votes. Ladies Auxiliary from the VFW in third place, People's Choice. Great job, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Second place for People's Choice are Mad Scientists. Okay, hold your applause. First place for People's Choice, Valaris. Congratulations. Okay, kids, give them a cheer. Come on up, kids. You guys deserve it too. Thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody.
Okay. Alright, alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, Moving on to the best chili. I think there was some tough, tough, tough competition. The judges had a hard time. And we are giving an honorable mention. It was so close. It was very close. Honorable mention has to go to Windsor Volunteer Ambulance. Alan? They are in this every year. They're tough competitors, have won placed almost every year, and they have a great chili. Come on up. Very good. Third place. I think they have been in the top before. Izote, third place. Rich and company, you guys did a great job. Thank you so much. Thank you. Good job. Number two, second place in the tasting blind taste test by our eight judges, Carmen for Community Funeral Homes. Congratulations. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yes. This year's winner for the best chili in all of Windsor, Windsor Republican Town Committee, Mike McDonald was a chef once again. Awesome job. Cooked right here on the green. Congratulations, guys. We have some other awards coming up. The Kiwanis. Yeah, I'm going to turn the mic over to the Kiwanis who do a great job supporting the Windsor Food and Fuel Bank. John Degada. Awesome. Here you go, John. Thank you. On behalf of the Windsor Kiwanis Club, uh, it's my honor to let you know what we had gathered for food and cash today for the Windsor Food and Fuel Bank. Before I tell you the amounts, uh, I just want to let everybody know who's involved in this. Uh, first of all, the Windsor Kiwanis Club, of course. Uh, our feeder programs, the K-Kids out of JFK and Clover Street. Boy Scouts, Troop 149. The Women's Club. And the Town of Windsor, <laughs> of course. And, uh, and individuals. So it tallied up. Uh, most food overall and a total for uh, a complete uh, food and cash. 
The most food was the Women's Club of Windsor with $1,088. The overall was the town of Windsor, $4,032. And a complete total, including all the individuals that I have mentioned, the Kiwanis Club, the young kids at JFK, Clover Street, and the, and the Boy Scouts. Now, each pound of food is equivalent to a dollar. So there was a total of a grand total of $8,551. And the last thing, we try to make this a fun thing and uh, we try to decorate the canoes. Um, uh, the weather didn't really uh, do wonders for us today, but we did have the women's club who really did a great job and they also got the prize for best canoe. I thank everybody on behalf of the Kiwanis Club. On behalf of the Windsor Chamber of Commerce, I want to thank everyone for coming out and Hold on, we forgot the trophies from the Kiwanis. Nice job, Nagana. I made the announcement that I didn't hand out the trophies. So we'll start with the town of Windsor. Who's ever representing the town of Windsor? All right. Congratulations. Next uh, would be the uh, the women's uh, the Windsor Women's Club. They've gotten two trophies. They got the best canoe, uh, the creativity on the best canoe, and uh, the most uh, food collected. So once again, thank you everyone for coming out to the 2014 uh, Chili Challenge. Thank you.